your boy, Spider Man, aka D Man. Your man, I'm sitting here with my sister, my day one, the one who holds it down for me, my co host, Daria. Say what's up, Daria. What's up, Daria? And welcome to the Trailer Drops, our trailer reaction and review show for the channel. We got our fourth and final one, part of the Disney Investor Day. We said we're going to do things a little bit different for today. No major trailers, but instead, we're going to be talking about what's coming down the pipeline. This time, we're going to be focusing on Marvel Studios, all the stuff that's happening within the next two to three days years but before we get started y'all know the drill if you like to see this channel continue to grow and thrive please make sure to subscribe to us hit the little bell icon so you get notifications for every video that we make that we want to bring just to you all the things that we find absolutely interesting ranging from movies to video games to wrestling to whatever we find an interest in we want to bring it right to you also like into the content that you do enjoy and comment down below because we do like to hear from you our kinds of faithful and also because the algorithm says you must let's get it going marvel Marvel. We've already started. We we kicked off this weekend of trailer drops. We did. By doing those four trailers. We already did the trailers for WandaVision, uh, the trailer for Falcon and the Winter Soldier, the trailer for Loki, and finally yeah. the trailer for Marvel's What If. We already did all of those. We're going to put those links in the description below if you ever want to catch up on that. We're also going to pop, be popping those cards up like you know here or there or wherever the cards show up somewhere we're gonna be popping off those cards so you can all catch up with all the stuff that we did for those major trailers right there so instead we're gonna be talking primarily about the stuff that didn't come packaged with a trailer and instead we're gonna be focusing primarily on the stuff that has been announced we got cast listings uh we got a uh, little brief sizzle reels uh, that, okay. that we're gonna be linking in the description below so you can you know go ahead and catch it catch that if you would like uh so let's go ahead and jump forward uh as we said we already did wandavision we already did falcon we already did loki we already did what else we're gonna be starting with shang chi and uh the legend of the ten rings now okay. this one is going to be pretty amazing because we guess who we see once again aquafina yeah this is going to be a nice little cast that I, that I see right here. It's coming out July 9th, 2021. Oh, okay. Uh, this upcoming year. Uh, I'm hoping that this does for um, the Asian and Pacific Islander community. Uh, uh, please. Uh, that the same thing that, that happened with Black Panther and yeah. us. Uh, yeah. You know, being able to see yourself on the screen is absolutely important. It's very important. Uh, especially when we have this big multicultural world that we're in. Yes. So this was going to be a really big thing happening July 9th. I can't is wait for that. Is this a series or a movie? This is a movie. Okay, this so this could, movie. this could be a potential new character. Oh, we we already we already we're already going to be seeing seeing a lot of this. Okay. Uh, so I, I want to delve more into uh, the property itself. Okay. Uh, just really to see you know a lot of things that are going to be very interesting right here coming with that. Uh, okay. But we got uh, we got that we have uh, the likes of uh, Shima Lu, uh, Tony uh, Tony Wang, uh, as we said Aquafina, yes. um, Michelle Yeoh, uh, some names that we we've already seen before in, in other properties. So yeah. I'm really excited yeah. about this because Michelle Yeoh is uh, in uh... no. You're I'm trying to think else? on Netflix. I probably am. You're thinking about somebody else, aren't I you? I probably am. You're struggling. I am. You have a phone Shield. right there. Shield. Agents of Shield. <laughs> I was trying to get it. I was trying. You were struggling. Already. You were it's, struggling. Is that her? I don't think it is. That's a different one. Okay. They they favor. Wow. How was that a wow? Wow. Could have just picked up your phone and been like, hey, hold on one second. I thought and that you was took her. took a stab in the dark I, instead. I did. Moving I'm on. I'm trying to figure out the title, dude. Mo moving on. Uh, we have a new sizzle reel for Ms. Marvel. Mm -hmm. That's coming down uh, the pipeline late 2021. So they're already jumping right into pushing pushing phase five. Okay. For Marvel. So 2021 is about to be really action-packed. Hopefully, once we get out of this panda, we will be able to do some things uh, with that. Again, Please. I said in the previous video, if I if I had a choice not to hit the movie theaters, I, I would. But... But... When it comes to some of this stuff right here, hopefully we'll see some some interesting things popping up right here. Okay. Uh, we already got the sequel to Captain Marvel announced. Uh, same people are going to be playing there. Uh, this is going to be Brie Larson. Now, Nia DaCosta... <laughs> She was, uh, she's the director for uh, the upcoming uh, Candyman that had to get pushed back due to this pan pizza. Oh yeah. Uh, so I'm already, I'm already excited about her being attached as the uh, director uh, for the upcoming uh, Captain Marvel two. Here's, okay. you know, we can see maybe uh, we can see some interesting stuff coming up right now. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. But we got some, we got some stuff with, uh, with uh, Captain Marvel uh, right there. It's possibly coming. Um, no, they say they have the date. Who knows? November 11th, 2022. Okay. Captain Marvel, November 11th, 22. We got a lot of these dates. Yeah. I'm, I'm going to I'm gonna have to keep these dates 
in the in the in the comments. In your phone book. Yes, uh, all that good stuff. Your phone book, uh, not me. Your date book. Animaniacs brain, dude. Animaniacs brain. Move on. Are you saying Animaniacs brain because you goofy? No. That's the reason I'm saying. Uh, we also got a t- Eternals announced. Our boy Brian Terry Henry. Yay! A bunch of names and uh, attached to this one. Mm-hmm. Uh, no dates, just just an announcement. They got a, they got a nice class list. Uh, so we're, we're we're already hoping for a lot of good things from there once that gets further developed. Uh, speaking of developments, uh, we got everybody's least favorite Avenger. <laughs> I, that's not a hot take. Like tell tell me who's sitting not here. Not really. Who's not who's, really. Sit, who's sitting here going like, oh Hawkeye. Yo, it's Hawkeye. Let's let's it's You're Hawkeye. The best. It's yeah. Hawkeye. Okay. I mean, like, if if it wasn't like save the world type shit, then yeah. But like, this, we're talking save the world type shit. Hawkeye. Okay. Hawkeye. Okay. Hawkeye. But anyway, we got Hawkeye. Uh, it's coming out. Same people attached to that. Jeremy Renner is reprising his role. Okay. Uh, we got some more. Uh, like for instance, uh, we got ourselves uh, She Hulk that got announced. Uh, okay. Tatiana Maslany. Uh, she got Jennifer Walters and Mark Ruffalo was joining in as well. Okay. Uh, again, again, some of these are just straight up announced, but this is coming to uh, Disney Plus uh, right here. So uh, we got some more. Again, we got Disney Plus is really becoming like the big thing okay. over the next two to three years when it comes down to uh, potential uh, releases properties and, and releases yeah. and, and uh, content. So you're getting a lot of bang for your buck. Hopefully they won't pull a Netflix and raise your prices, Netflix. <laughs> My lord. Uh, again, uh, original series, Moon Knight, uh, just got announced. Same thing here for um, uh, Secret Invasion. A lot of the, as, as we got a lot of the, you know, these jumping in right here. Okay. Because uh, we got ourselves uh, Sam Jackson. When was the last time you saw Sam Jackson in an actual series? Mm. Like, I think he made a cameo once or twice in like season six of S.H.I.E.L.D. Yeah. Yeah, like maybe once it. or twice. But like, Sam Jackson is going to be attached to this series, A Secret Invasion. Again, coming to Disney Plus, uh, M- uh, Miss Mar- uh, Captain Marvel is also going to be popping in uh, here and there. Oh, so okay. it's going to be really, you know, really interesting to see what they do with that. Um, mm. Ironheart, my girl Riri Williams. Oh yeah, is going to be taking over the uh, over the helm of the Iron X thing, like Iron Man, but now she's Ironheart. Okay. So that's going to be fun. Uh, so I heard that announced. I was really excited about that. We're going to jump right into having some fun right there. Another Disney Plus uh, exclusive right there. No movie theaters for that one. Okay. Uh, so she's going to be down the armor. Also, Don Cheadle gets himself his own little thing with Armor Wars. Well, about time. Again, coming to Disney Plus. Okay. Man, bruh, bruh, what's his name? It's hard out here for a pimp. What's his name? Terrence Howard. Yeah. You done fucked up. What did he do? He was the original uh, War Machine. Before, oh, before he, he got was, to... Before it got to Don Cheadle. Yeah, he yeah. was in... Uh, yeah, he, he was, was in Iron Man 1. one. Yeah. And, and he done fricked it up. It's like, you could have yeah. had all of this, bruh. Yeah, and they, and they actually... He actually... Maine. Played the hell out of that. Maine. The fuck? Yeah. Oh, language. I'll move on. Okay. <laughs> I'll move on. I'll move on. All right. <laughs> We have Guardians of the Galaxy holiday special that's also popping over to Disney Plus, but that's popping over in 2022. James oh, okay. Gunn uh, is uh, writing this one, writing and directing uh, the holiday special. We don't oh, know what's okay. going on with that, but like that's that got announced. Um, I Am Groot is getting its own little series uh, with Baby Groot, oh, okay. but it's going to be like little shorts, uh, so they're not going to be focusing too much on like you know long form series. So it's just okay. going to be like little shorts that's popping over here on uh, Disney. <gasps> Ooh, excuse me, Disney Plus. <clears throat> oh, excuse me. I, Dude, what is going on right here? Don't know. Get it together. It's, I'm getting it together. They're bringing back Blade. The vampire movie. They're bringing back Blade. Now, out of all of the Marvel properties, I... Well, hot take. Hot take. Okay. If not for Blade, I don't think that we would ever have... That we would have this rush of uh, comic book movies that we do right now. Because what? Blade's success uh, like in the in the late 90s, early 2000s... Yeah compared to everything else is, is the one that I think really jump started it because it came before X-Men. It came after Spawn, I think. But Spawn kind of tanked. 
As, as, as it a, did. It did. Yeah. Spawn was first. Yeah, Spawn. I had to I think, think about it. Yeah, Spawn, Spawn came was out like first. a year before Blade. Yes. But Blade with Wesley Snipes. This one is going to be starring Mahershala Ali. Okay. He's going to be taking up the role of the vampire. I hope we see a cameo with Wesley. It's gotta have. Please make it happen. Just, 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 just fill, just fill my my fanboy art, please. I want to see that happening. Okay. Uh, we have the the third film in the Ant Man and uh, Ant Man saga. Well, this one will be Ant Man and the Wasp: Quantumania. Mania. Everybody's coming back to okay. that. That got it. That got itself announced. Okay. Oh, that's gonna that. be fun. Uh, they got a date for this one. Okay. And I I'm very intrigued for it. Black Panther two, uh, coming out July eighth, twenty twenty two. Uh, they're not re uh recasting. I was gonna uh, say Chad what Bo, the late Chadwick Boseman okay. as T'Challa. Uh, but they are keeping everybody the same. Uh, with this, I don't know what the story's going to be. Don't know uh, whose cast is. Maybe we're going to be seeing uh, Shuri take over the helm. Uh, Letitia okay. Wright, after she took that L for her, you know, anti-vaccine stuff on Twitter, uh, hopefully she can keep her head low up until then yeah. so that the, the, the excitement for Black Panther 2 doesn't doesn't wane. But yeah. uh, Shuri um, most, uh, is likely going to be the one who takes up the man. Who knows? Okay. I, I, that, that's 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 what I think is, that thing might happen. Who knows? Okay. And finally, 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 the third time's the charm. Actually, fourth time's the charm. Is this the fourth time? Yeah, because technically they had an attempt at fi- at Fantastic Four like in the early '90s, late '80s. I want to say. Is it, where they started it? Yeah, that's, that's when they had their first stab at it, I believe. Okay. Uh, and then they had the one that happened in the early 2000s. They had, the the, they had a Surfer? sequel. Yeah, the, the, the Silver yeah. Surfer was a sequel for that one. And that was that. And then they brought in Michael B. Jordan, and they had Fan Stick, and that happened a few years ago. That was with the teenagers, right? No, not so... Uh, uh, not really. It, it's, it was just whack. It was just whack. Maybe that's what it was. I don't it know. was just whack. I don't know. Honestly, put that on Disney Plus. Let, let's watch that one and review that shit. But when they did it with Fan Force, so technically this is the fourth time is the charm with Fantastic Four. No one's attached to it yet. It's just okay. got announced. No okay. dates, no actors, no directors. They just like, They're we're just doing it. They're considering it. it. We're doing it. We're, we're going to be pushing through for it. So who knows what they do okay. with Fantastic Four. Now, out of all the stuff that we talked about right here, including the ones that we did during the trailer drops uh, the previous day. Yeah. What are you most excited for when it comes down to this Marvel uh, release? All uh, of them. I'm just going to make it easy. No, that's making it hard. Give me like one that you're like um, super excited about. I will say Black Panther 2. That's fair. Fair news. I fair news. Say Black That's Panther fair news. Too. Fair news. Because I've been waiting on Black yeah. Panther too. Yeah. All right. Yeah. 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 I, I, I'll I'll rock that. I think I missed one thing that I wanted Who? to talk about. Oh yeah, uh, our boy Jonathan Majors is the is the bad guy in, in Ant Man of the Wasp: Quantum Mania. Oh, okay. Uh, tick from a uh, um, Lovecraft Country. Oh. Yeah. He's gonna be playing the bad guy. Awesome. So uh, he's going to be playing uh, Kang the Conqueror. So you know okay. what? That's that's one I'm more, most excited about because I want to see what they do with him. Okay. Uh, because the problem with 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 Marvel is a lot of their villains are just like one and done characters. A lot of them. Yeah. Are uh, unless like you're you're talking about like a property like Spider Man or something. Yeah. Where now we have Spider. This is this wasn't in this wasn't in any of this release. This is all stuff that's been happening over the past month or two. Yeah. Okay. So upcoming Spider Man three. Of course, you got Tom Holland. Yes. You got Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield also popping back. Those are from okay. Amazing Spider-Man and the Sam Raimi Spider-Man. Uh, you have uh, the Doc Ock uh, from Sam Raimi Spider-Man. You've got Jamie Foxx playing uh, Shocker, I believe. Yeah. From Amazing Spider-Man. Um, who else did they announce? Oh, uh, Kirsten Dunst, right? Oh, she's coming back. She's coming back as Mary Jane Watson. Okay. Um who else? They've been made, they've been naming a lot of people that's been popping back just for this. Okay, and it's it's crazy. And the one thing that I'm actually waiting for is I need to see who's going to be the Miles Morales. I don't care. I mean, I do care if he's just going to be like an end stinger because that's going to suck. Yeah. But but give me some Miles Morales fun. Yeah. Up in this yeah. now the the interesting part is what I did miss is. Uh, they did announce that they were going to be doing a Doctor Strange 2, and that's going to be a multiverse thing. Okay. They already teased it with uh, Far From Home with uh, the fake from Earth 626 yeah. uh, or 616, or I can't remember which, which Earth, uh, the fake uh, Mysterio 
who was going to be coming, who came from Parallel Universe. That was his big story, even though he wasn't from Parallel Universe. Uh, but they already teased it with that. Uh, hopefully, Doctor Strange and the events of what happened in Endgame is going to to make that a thing happening further on. Okay. Uh, maybe then we're going to start seeing, uh, maybe that's where we're getting uh, uh, Fantastic Four from. Maybe that's where we're going to be getting some crossover with the mutants and X-Men. Okay. Who knows? But like, Quantumania and what's happening with Doctor Strange and likely Spider-Man 3 is what I'm most excited for okay. uh, coming from Marvel within the next few years. But anyway, let us know down in the comments below what you thought, what are you very excited for uh, as we come over and talk about Marvel's uh, Mar the Marvel side of the Disney Investor Day. Also, head on over to patreon.com slash where you can get updates on the site, the store, and the channel also participate in exclusive little events exclusive to our patrons. Head on over also to hillcottage.com slash shop. We're going to be eventually slashing some prices for the holiday season where you can get some new merch. She's wearing some new merch. Well, not new. It was one of our older shirts, but still, still, still good. Still great Christmas gift. Say it. Great Christmas gift. Yes. So thank you guys for joining us. We hope you're having a wonderful time, a wonderful weekend. Hope you have a wonderful Christmas and holiday season. And we'll catch y'all on the next Trailer Drops. Deuces.